Swipe on Megan, Duchess of Sussex's former best friend Jessica Moroni pays tribute to the friends who loved and stand by her unconditionally in the gushing birthday post. Meghan Markle's former best friend Jessica Moroni has paid tribute to the friends who loved and stood by her unconditionally amid rumors her friends with the Duchess of Sussex has diminished. The mother of three from Toronto celebrated her 43rd birthday earlier this month and spent the weekend partying with friends. Earlier today, the stylist who met the Duchess of Sussex while she was still staring in suits shared a glimpse of her birthday night out with her 410,000 Instagram followers. She captioned the post, I'm not a big birthday girl, but this year I wanted to celebrate some of the women that have loved and stood by me unconditionally. I am so lucky to have so many smart girls in my life, and you too, Ryan. I'm a lucky lady, she said. For her birthday party, the Model 3 looked cheek in a sleeveless black polo neck, top, and trousers. The post included photos of Jessica curling up with makeup artist Rachel Arena and others of the group gathered around a table and drinking champagne. Other guests invited on Jessica's night out included Joanna Griffiths, the CEO of the underwear brand Nick's Wear. The Duchess of Sussex and Jessica Moroney are believed to have met when Meghan was still staring in suits and the former actress even gushed about her Tresco stylist friend on a block the tape. Although Jessica's three children were included in Meghan Markle's wedding party in May 2018, it appears as though the two women's friendship has cooled in recent years. In 2020, Jessica Moroni became embroiled in a white privileged role with lifestyle blogger Sasha Exeter. Following the murder of George Floyd in May 2020, Sasha posted on her Instagram stories and encouraged her followers and fellow influencers to speak out about the Black Lives Matter movement. However, the blogger claims Jessica took offense from her generic call to action post. In a follow-up video, Sasha said, What happened next was a series of a very problematic behavior and antics. I'm by no means calling Jess a racist, but what I would say is this. She is very well aware of her wealth, perceived power, and privilege because of the color of her skin, and that my friends give her the momentary confidence to come for my livelihood in writing. Textbook um, white privilege, really, in my personal opinion. Following the blogger's claim, Jessica issued three public apologies. However, she still faced consequences and was dropped by numerous television networks. DailyMail.com exclusively revealed that ABC severed ties with her, confirming that Jessica would not be returning to her occasional role as a fashion contributor on Good Morning America. Canadian TV network CTV also cut off ties with a stylist, revealing that it would be pulling all episodes of her wedding-themed reality TV show, I Do Redo, from its platform. Since then, Jessica has not commented on rumors of her drifting apart from Megan.